Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with the first week of January reads start from the 1st through the 7th of January 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Gemini. So Gemini, let's see what's coming in for you for the first week of January time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned How before I dive into the read. Let me remind you, it's a general reading, hit when it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see. We do have Four of Swords. Um, Gemini, I really feel like you know, there's something. Um, somebody out there in your life right now who is ignoring you neglecting you making you feel bad in the current situation um but deep down they themselves are not feeling good um so if somebody has been ignoring you lately just know that this person is also not feeling good about the whole situation um they know that they are somehow making a mistake there but they are so choosing a certain way of being right now with you um, I feel like, you know, for some of you, this person might be trying to make you jealous with, with their behavior. Uh, maybe you see them hanging out with other people in their life right now. Maybe they are trying to make you jealous and they know that they are doing something wrong here. Um, they, I really feel like, you know, you, your person, whoever it is that you have on my on your mind right now, that you're dealing with right now in your life, I feel like, you know, this person is... Um, You know what I'm picking up? It seems like you know this person is putting something on the social media which is making you feel like, you know, jealous. Um, whether they're doing it purposely or because of their work they have to do that. But there is something which is definitely bothering you. You really feel like, you know, there is a third party situation between you and this person now. You really feel like, you know, they are having a good time in their life, but maybe whatever they're, they're doing right now, maybe that they are ignoring you, maybe they're hanging out with certain people and they're putting some pictures out there in the, on, on the social media, which making you feel like maybe, you know, um, you you don't mean a much, you know, much to this person anymore. But I really feel like, you know, it's not how you're perceiving it to be, to be honest. I really feel like, you know, there is something that is definitely bothering you right now about this person. But in actuality, the case is not how you're perceiving it to be. Um, I really see you disappointed in this person, whoever it is that you're dealing with, but it's not the case. I really feel like you know, there is some sort of misunderstanding. I feel like you know, it's just like you're overthinking and overanalyzing everything that you're seeing right now. There's a lot happening behind the curtains that you are unaware of. So I really feel like you know you would feel like walking away this from this person. You would feel like you need to move on. Uh, because you really feel like, you know, you don't want to deal with this situation anymore because you're always a third person in their life. You're always the least important person in their life. So you feel kind of ignored and neglected um, during this week time by this person. And I feel like you know, that's something which is uh, getting heavy on you and you really don't want to deal with this. Um, there is some issue um, that is, you know, I really feel like it's more of the issue in your life than in their life. I feel like, you know, they are dealing with something regarding their work. Uh, maybe they have to attend certain parties or get togethers. You see them attending all of that. You feel ignored and neglected. You feel that they are not like entrusted. Maybe they have moved on. Maybe they have another person. In actuality, it's not the case. And I feel like, you know, maybe you are kind of like, you know, spying on them or the energies could be vice versa for some of you. Uh, maybe there is a person out there who is interested in you and, you know, you are being busy with a lot of things happening in your personal life. And this person, whoever it is that you are dealing with, they think that you are ignoring them and you are having a good time in your life. Uh, but I really feel like, you know, the case is not like that. I feel like, you know, somebody is being misunderstood here uh, during this week time. And um, I really feel like, you know, somebody would want to put an end to the whole situation because it's getting toxic. So whether it's for you or for your person, you really, you know, I really feel like you know, somebody would want to walk away from the situation rather than like, you know, talking through things and, you know, making things work. I really see some sort of pain and suffering that is going on between you and a specific someone. And I really don't see the two of you communicative about it. So maybe you are in a no contact situation and you're spying on each other 
and just making you feel like you know oh my god something is like you know missing and something is lost between the two of you maybe you don't share the same chemistry or something but it's it's more like a mutual feeling is what i'm picking up here but the two of you are not talking here so i really feel like you know the situation is going to stay the same you're going to feel left out and it's a mutual thing so it's not that they are having fun and you are not or you are having fun and they are not it's more like um you both are you know misunderstanding each other's uh, you know situation right now let's see what else is coming in for you for this week time <clears throat> gemini's strategy rest and rejuvenate financial constraints now i really feel like you know there there is something to do with finances work career which is uh um the reason the whole situation has happened so um, maybe, maybe you feel like your person has lost interest in you and they're choosing other people and they're choosing, you know, their, their other like group of people, they have changed the job and you are like, you know, sticking in a different job. Maybe if you, if you were connected to each other through your work, maybe you feel like a distance between the two of you. I really feel like, you know, the two of you, um, are kind of like, you know, creating this, allowing this energy or the situation to create distance between the two of you. You got to talk to each other. You'd got to kind of sit and talk and, uh, you know, try to make things work in this connection, in this situation, especially if your work and your love life is connected. I really feel like, you know, you have to talk through, uh, talk through things with each other. You cannot like let this uh, influence your love life with each other. I really feel like, you know, you need to kind of talk through things clear the misunderstanding and all is going to be well but this week is going to be heavy on you and your person in this relationship because i really see that there is a lot of misunderstanding being created here and um, you know one person is more occupied with the work and you know stuff like that than the other so let's see the color card let's see what color could be lucky for you for this week time wow so lilac color is going to be lucky for you it's time for you to strengthen your faith number 42 um, I feel like, you know, it's very important right now to keep your faith strong around whatever it is that you want and desire in this connection. Discover your sparkle number 26 and you have to kind of believe in yourself as well. If you don't have confidence in yourself and you believe that your person can lose interest in you so easy, then that's the issue that you need to fix there at first place. So it's very important for you to know your worth. Um, for some of you, uh, blue with a pinch of white can be a significant color then with lilac color also i feel like you know things can get easy for you try to sense in your faith and try to work on building some confidence and know that you are somebody special you know what you have to offer the other person doesn't have uh, or other people cannot have that to offer so if you're confident that way i feel like you know things are going to be easier on you and your connection so try to work on that during this week time to eliminate the fear and doubtful thoughts. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. And if you are willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, check the description box for that. Till I do the next read, take care. Bye.